Good afternoon, YouTube. Back at you with another job today. Um, this one's going to be a familiar lot. If some of you watch the channel uh, about maybe 10, 11 months ago, 12, uh, some, well, almost a year, not quite. Uh, we cut this lot. It was really, really bad. But uh, I am back at it to cut it again. And it's really not as bad as it was. So it should go pretty quick but i'm pretty much going from you know kind of where the trees are at up to the back of the tree line and then kind of where that fence is make a bee line um i kind of know most of the stuff's in there there is you know a boat trailer a couple little uh, there's a couple little auto parts stuff around the um <clears throat> a tree right there to watch but i am gonna walk it one more time just to make sure that there's nothing in there but it should go pretty quick now <clears throat> but uh if you hadn't seen the video it was um labeled violation lot i put a link in the description but uh some of y'all um have been asking for me to put the equipment i'm using in the description but i usually just try to tell you what i'm going to use for the day so this is what i'm using for today got the 790 it is a 30 horse john deere tractor uh, I've got a little four foot bush hog, which is for this size lot is perfect for it. Um, could have used the flail mower. I don't like using the flail mower on this tall, like dogwood and viney stuff. Uh, it just gets wrapped up around the uh, drum. So brush cutters are the better way. It's a little bit too tall for the finishing mower. Um, it probably could cut it, but I just don't want to risk the damage. So anyway brush cutters are probably the best for this application it is just pretty much tall grass uh and there's not a lot of sticks or anything in that nature so anyway got a trailer boat little debris pile i think i have another little debris pile over here but anyway i'm gonna quit talking i'm gonna get to work it is kind of hot this is um the hottest part of the season here in central mississippi where we're at oh and by the way if you guys don't know my name is john welcome to the channel for the new subscribers that actually stick and stay <sighs> anyway um i'm gonna try to put the camera in the shade here in central mississippi the um heat index gets really really hot and it overheats these cameras so i'll try to keep an eye on it make sure it records but i'm just gonna hit some of the highlights of this project
well YouTube this is one of the things that you're gonna find when you're brush cutting um, hidden treasures is what I call them this is actually looks like weed eater string um, <laughs> you know sometimes you can walk through stuff and you're not gonna see it just because it gets buried up underneath that thick grass but um, always have yourself some cutters and, and stuff to uh, be able to you know take care of this whether it's grinders for, you know for wire and stuff because this this stuff will slow you down um, but anyway uh, a little progress report so like I said <clears throat> so uh, I got a little areas to hit so I'm, I'll hit this with string trimmers here later not going past that tree line right here I got a little bit on this edge to hit and then uh, of course burn piles right here and then I got to catch this little edge along this property line and around these boats and what I do is I typically just get as much as I can with the brush cutter and then I'll come in with the string trimmer and just knock down the rest of the stuff so anyway <clears throat> I'm gonna take a little quick water break and uh, we'll get back on it on the road I've been away for far too long But now I'm on my way back home I hear the west winds calling I'm a name They telling me to head your way Down your road and past your gates Keep your eyes on the horizon I was looking to belong when I'd already found my home Won't be long, I'm there before the setting sun For you to fall into my arms, the place I call my home I was looking to belong when I already found my home
All right, YouTube. So, um, yeah, most of the brush cutting is done. Pretty much, actually, pretty much all of it. Uh, I'm going to hop on the string trimmer, trim up some of the stuff. I'll, let, I'll film some of it. I'm not going to hit you with every little detail. But, uh, yeah, and then I got to blow off the street. You get some of that grass that I threw out there. there YouTube just got done blowing off and uh, got everything weed whacked like I said that's just a fire pile uh, but let me show you the end results so yeah like I said bush hogging is kind of a slow process lots of um, roots kind of can't see it right there but you probably saw it in the video um, just obstacles but yeah it's a little easy to knock down got around that tree This will be good for about a, another year unless they want it done sooner. But um, but yeah, the only thing I got to do is I got to put the old 790 uh, back on the trailer. Oh, and for those that follow the channel, I finally got me a new seat. It was just cheaper to buy a new one than to reupholster the uh, original. So yeah. I've only been telling y'all that for like, two years i was getting a new seat but uh yeah i just gotta pick up a few little trash pieces and uh kind of clean clean up that and then that's it but anyway give me a like comment and uh if you think this channel's worthy give it a subscribe um i appreciate you tagging along and we'll see you on the next job peace guys thanks for watching the junkies